Hello everybody, today I have this Fraenel Cascadia. I'm going to be replacing the front shock absorbers. As you can see, they're leaking. They're all wet. Uh, and plus, they're loose. See, this ball is completely loose. Uh, that's not good. So, I'm going to be replacing the balls and the shock absorbers. This is a very common problem to find in fractional cascadias with the shock absorber. Then the ball gets loose. This is caused because the ball gets stretched. And when you replace the shocks, you reinstall the same ball. But over the time, the ball gets loose and starts causing these problems. So I'm going to be using a 118 socket and wrench and an impact gun. To remove the two bolts. In some cases these bolts are stuck and you will need to cut them. Okay I have the two oil shock absorbers out. As you can see the bushing is almost destroyed as you can see. This one is still okay. And we have the ball here. As you can see it's all messed up because it was completely loose. So I wanna be installing a new bolt as I said before because the cause of this problem then this bolt gets loose is because it's trash. Uh, and to prevent that, always every time then you replace the shock absorber, you need to replace it. Uh, you need to replace the new bolts to prevent this problem. Because it damages your uh, mounting bracket the shock absorber mounting bracket on the lead frame as you can see the orifice is bigger now it's still okay but in some cases it can damage it more than that and you will need to replace this i have the new shock absorber here is the part number and i have the four new bolts for the new shock absorbers and the washers first i'm going to install some anises in the bolts to prevent corrosion okay with the two bolts on place i'm gonna be installing the shock absorber and now i'm gonna place the two washers and the two nuts now i'm going to tie them with the bolts completely tight i'm going to cut this and i'm gonna remove it the shock absorbers are fully installed always double check remember to check the other shock absorbers in this case we can see then this shock absorber is loose see you can see it's open from this side and this one too see it is completely loose so check them all the time to prevent any other damage in this case they're not leaking they, they look okay as you can see so I'm just gonna tie these bolts prevent any future problems with and this is all I'm going to show you about the shock absorber replacement if you have any questions about this video just comment below and I will answer them as soon as I can like share subscribe and thank you for watching